guys and girls today we are going to start financial management in the last semester you have completed financial accounting analysis so financial accounting analysis ends with the preparation of final accounts that is we are going to prepare final accounts as all you know that balance sheet is the final thing which we will prepare right so as you are very much familiar with this now i am going to converse this into financial management so financial management in that liabilities we have long term liabilities and short term liabilities so the short term liabilities are also considered as current liabilities whereas here you have fixed assets and current assets so now based upon this balance sheet what we are going to learn in financial management let's start up long term liabilities are the sources of funds like you have equity capital preference capital debt bonds long term loans etc and when it comes to fixed assets we'll consider it as application of funds so we are going to the funds which we have sourced we are going to apply on fixed assets like plant and machinery land and buildings furniture fixtures like that so as all of you know so here in financial management as all you know that the topics are divided into various aspects so whatever the application of funds are there that we are going to learn here as capital budgeting or long term investment decisions so here in fixed asset whatever you are applying there we are going to learn it as long term investment decision making or capital budgeting okay and from wherever we are sourcing our funds whenever we source the funds we have two concepts in mind one is cost of capital so what is the cost that we are going to incur whenever we are going to source these funds that's what we are going to learn as cost of capital and another one is capital structure so from sources of funds we are going to learn cost of capital and capital structure whereas in application of funds on long term fixed assets so capital budgeting or long term investment decision making we are going to do apart from this here we are also going to study about dividend decisions in order to keep our equity shareholders or preference shareholders happy so the dividend decisions and how they are going to impact upon our company or organization we are going to see and when it comes to current assets and current liabilities here we are going to learn by using them working capital management so your entire financial management is divided into five units one is what are the financial management goals in the first unit and in the second unit we are going to learn the capital budgeting or long term investment decisions in the third unit we are going with cost of capital and capital structure in fourth unit we are going to see about dividend decisions and in the fifth unit we are going to see working capital management so this is briefly about your financial management what we are going through in the coming sessions